If you're like me, you absolutely despise typing in the at livingstonschools.net address. It's such a colossal pain. And I spoke with Heather White, who has some amazing tips for us. If you haven't met her, you're missing out. But this tip, I was like, we have to share. So here's the trick. First off, open up your Google Chrome browser up at the top where it says google.com or whatever your homepage is. Erase it and type in classroom.google.com backslash a backslash livingstonschools.net. Yes, I understand that this is a pain too, but you only have to do it one time, okay? So, and I'm gonna leave it up here at the top throughout this little presentation so you can just pause the video, type it in and catch up with me later. But it's also gonna be up here. So you type it in, you hit enter. This is what happens. So now that at livingstonschools.net part is already typed in. All right, so yeah, right now you're all like, I love you, Nikki. Honestly, it's from Heather White, but whatever, you can love me too. So now we're gonna figure out how to keep it like that all the time so your kid does not have to type that in. First thing we're gonna do, step one, we're gonna add it to our bookmark bar. And like you have google.com up here, whatever. These little things right here are my bookmarks, okay? To add it to this list, you're gonna hit that star and it's gonna bookmark it so it stays up here. So you can just go to the top, click it and open it up every time. So that's the first thing we're gonna do. The next thing, that's true, yep, okay. We're gonna make it an icon so that it's on your computer, on the desktop, so your kid can just click, click and then Open it up, okay? So at the top right corner of your browser, so you still have it open, you're still on that same page, you're gonna click on these three dots. I know they call them like a hamburger or something. Or snowman, which I think is kinda cute. So we're gonna click on those three dots. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna scroll down here to where it says more tools. You're gonna click on more tools. Then you're gonna hit create shortcut. When you click on that, this is gonna pop up. Here's where you can change the name. It can say to Google Classroom. If you're at home and your kid's name is locked, it can say lock, click here, whatever you wanna call it, okay? Click that, hit create. And then look, it's an icon on your desktop, making your life easier. And when they click on that icon, it's gonna to go to that login screen where at livingstonschools.net is already typed in for them. So. There you go. Hope that makes your life a little bit easier.